And now we will unveil that gallant lady. All that mattered 27 years ago today, the Statue of Liberty. President Ronald Reagan relit the torch after an $87 million renovation that kicked off a three-day celebration of Lady Liberty's centennial and reopening. Experts spent two years repairing holes in the copper skin and replacing the original torch and flame. Last fall, the statue was closed yet again after Liberty Island was flooded by Superstorm Sandy. But today, the island and the statue will Good be that. open once again. And we will bring it to you right here on CBS This yeah. Morning. So yeah, beautiful. She's I was, very I was there when Reagan did that. It was just <clears throat> an amazing moment in New York history. You can feel it. I've Statue. never been. I've never been. I always say I'm going to go at least once. You shouldn't be a New Yorker and not go, so you've been. Yeah, exactly. I, of course, you've just you've to been. clarify, see, this, I haven't. Yeah. the statue opened tomorrow, I should just clarify that. Okay. But such a symbol for so many people who've come to this country, yeah. Lady Liberty. So and tomorrow you get on that little boat and go right over there. Mm -hmm. My own grandparents who well, signed in. That's one way to do it. <laughs> No, I really do Your want to go. Have you been, Nora? Si signed, signed in at Ellis Island, my grandmother. Is that yes. right? Yeah. From Ireland. Yes, in 1920. What a great story. Yeah. You're in New York. Were they now. named you O'Donnell then? Well, my grandmother was O'Kane. Oh. O'Kane, yes. All right. So, O'Donnell. Fast. Mm -hmm. Something for you and the kids and Jeff to do tomorrow, too. We could Absolutely. all get in that little boat together. All right. And head on it. over. Well, we're certainly dressed for Fourth of July early. Well, I'll just we, pick Gail? you up on mine. Yeah, I would like that, Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go anywhere you go. Are you too dating? <laughs> no, but... <laughs> But we have enormous affection. <laughs> he keeps begging. I keep telling him, no, it's not good to date co-workers.